हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सुरेश अग्रवाल मैथमेटिक्स शॉर्टकट्स बीइंग वेरी गुड इन मेंटल एडिशन फॉर्म्स द बेस ऑफ सो मेनी हायर कैलकुलेशन लाइक इवन सब्ट्रैक्शन एंड देन मल्टीप्लीकेशन स्क्वायरिंग स्क्वायर रूट्स क्यूब रूट्स क्यूबिंग यू नो मेंटल एडिशन इज द बेस एंड इफ यू आर गुड इन एडिंग नंबर्स एक्यूरेटली एंड क्विकली देन ऑब्वियसली दोज हायर कैलकुलेशन विल नॉट बी ए प्रॉब्लम फॉर यू सो इन दिस वीडियो i am going to take up a, an error free short trick i call it error free for a reason i tell you why uh, the students commit so many errors in addition of numbers so this is error free short trick to add large numbers even mentally yes and this is known as the dot method so those who know a little bit of vedic maths they must be knowing the dot method of adding the numbers now where do the students commit errors so i'll tell you that first and then i'll come to these questions which are written here before that i just want you to subscribe to the channel so that you know more and more people can join in and you can share the video if you like it at the end of the video and uh, uh, enable others also to learn these amazing tricks through which you can excel in mental mathematics and uh you know carry out these calculations in mind itself so was the entire video the errors in mental addition you know they come when you confront or face two digit numbers like if you have this question how are the students going to add them they will add all the unit digits right so 8 plus 9 i think that will be fine 17 plus 2 19 19 plus 7 now suddenly the numbers are getting bigger so if you have maybe 10 entries and you have to add all of them mentally then it becomes all the more difficult and the chances of errors they increase so how do we reduce the chances of errors now the, the dot method helps us in reducing the errors because we don't have to go beyond 18 1 8 18 yes so you will ask me if we have five numbers we have to go beyond 18 right but the dot method helps us in restricting ourselves to numbers below 18 and that's why the number of errors we make greatly reduce i'll show you how let's take this first example here we have 8 plus 6 right and i know that 8 plus 6 is 14 so before moving on to the next number i will consider this 14 as 4 in my mind and this 1 is to be carried forward so i will not write 1 in the next column i will put a dot and that is why i call it the dot method so 8 plus 6 is 14 so i will retain the 4 in the mind okay and i put a dot because it is more than 10 so 1 is carried forward so now 4 plus 5 is 9 and 9 plus 7 is 16 so 16 means i will retain the 6 and carry forward another dot so i'll put a dot anywhere in the second column it doesn't matter where you are putting the dot it has to be in the previous column now count the dot as 1 so 1 plus 4 is 5 5 plus 7 is 12 so 12 means i'll count it as 2 and i'll put a dot dot here in the previous column so 12 means 2 2 plus 8 again it is 10 10 means 0 and the dot again so 0 plus 1 is 1 1 plus 8 is 9 and finally the last column 5 plus 1 6 6 plus 9 is 15 so 5 and a 1 uh, in the next column so 5 plus 1 6 and a 1 dot here makes it One so one six nine six is the answer for this particular question. Likewise, in the second question, here I have five numbers and three of them are three digit numbers and two of them are two digit numbers. The method remains the same. Now we will try to increase the speed slowly. Okay, eight plus nine is seventeen. So seven. See, I put a dot immediately. As soon as I get a number more than ten. i will retain the unit digit in the mind and put a dot in the previous column okay so 8 plus 9 17 so 7 and a dot 
7 plus 2, 9. 9 plus 7, 16. So 6. 6 plus 4, 10. A dot and a 0. Here we have 1 plus 7, 8. 8 plus 6, 14. So 4. 4 plus 8, 12. So 2. 3. 12 again. So another dot. So 2. 3. And 7, 10. 10 means another dot and a 0. And likewise I can go on and on now. 3, 4, 9, 10. 10 means 0. 1, 2, 3. And the 1 here makes it 1300. Now see how quickly we are doing it now. We are saving so much of time because we don't have to count beyond 18. Right? Let's apply it here. We have 4 digit numbers. We have 3 digit numbers and a 2 digit number also. 8 plus 7, 15. So 5. 5 plus 7, 12, so 2. 2 plus 3, 5. 5 plus 7, 12, so 2. Now, 1 plus 9 is 10, so 0. 1, 4, 7, 8, 16, so 6. And now 6 plus 1, 7 plus 4, 11. 11 means 1. 1 plus 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And now 5, 6, 6, 12. So 1, 2, 9, 6, 2 is the sum. Now you can see we are saving so much of time because we don't have to count beyond 20 at least. Beyond 18, right? 9 plus 9 is 18. So I don't think you will get 19 also. Okay. Now this works very well if you practice it because most of the students, you know, they will say, I know the comments are coming very shortly that we knew, already knew this method, but did you use it in adding large numbers like this? That is the question. So application part is really important. If you start applying it, you start learning it. Let's see some more questions and then we'll move on to some different uh, questions where even decimals will be there. Okay. So the numbers are increasing now. We have five numbers out of which one, two, three, four. Four are four digit numbers and one of them is a three digit number. So 8 plus 4, 12, so 2, I'll put a dot, 2 plus 9, 11, so 1, 1 plus 6, 7, 7 plus 3, 10, so a 0, we have a 0 here, and then 10 means a 0, 4, 5, 5, 10, 10 means a 0, so again a 10, 10 means a 0, so 1 plus 8, 9, 9 plus 6, 15 means 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 means 0 and a 2. Right? 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 means a 0. 1 and 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 means a 0 and a dot. And the two dots here makes it 2. So, 2, 0, 2, 0, 0 is the sum. Likewise, here we have 5 digit numbers, 4 digit numbers, 3 digit numbers, everything in the question. So, let's start. 8 plus 4, 12. So, put a dot. 2, 2 plus 5, 7, 7 plus 7, 14, 14 means 4. See, as soon as you cross 10, you have to put a dot in the previous column, okay? So, 4, 4 plus 7, 11, so 1. So, we have a 1 at the end. Now, count the dots as 1, right? So, 1 plus 5, 6, 6 plus 6, 12, 12 means 2, 2 plus 6, 8, 9, 18, 18 means 8, 9, 13, 13 means 3. Start the next column, 6, 7, 13, 13 means 3, 11, 11 means 1, 2, 8, 9, 15, 15 means 5. Next column, 4, 5, 12, 12 means 2, 3, 4, 5, 13, 13 means 3. Next column, 3, 4, 5, 13, 13 means 1, 3, so 1, 3, 3, 5, 3, 1, is the sum. See, you will save a lot of time. You know, you need to practice 30, 40 questions and then you will feel more comfortable. Let's have six numbers, three digit, four digit, five digit numbers also. You can take six digit or even 10 digit numbers. The method will work equally well. Let's see. Eight plus nine is 17. So seven, seven plus four, 11 means one, one, four, five, 5 plus 3, 8, 8 plus 8, 16. 16 means 6. See the way I am putting the dots. That's what you need to learn here. 
वन प्लस सिक्स सेवन 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 फोर्टीन मीन्स फोर फाइव इलेवन इलेवन मीन्स वन थ्री फोर एट थर्टीन थर्टीन मीन्स थ्री नेक्स्ट कॉलम टू थ्री नाइन टेन टेन मीन्स जीरो फाइव सिक्स फिफ्टीन फिफ्टीन मीन्स फाइव सिक्स थर्टीन थर्टीन मीन्स थ्री द नेक्स्ट कॉलम दिस इज टेन टेन मीन्स जीरो एट नाइन फिफ्टीन फिफ्टीन मीन्स फाइव एंड वन सिक्स एंड फाइनली द लास्ट कॉलम फोर फाइव सिक्स एंड नाइन फिफ्टीन सो वन फाइव सिक्स थ्री थ्री सिक्स इज द सम ऑफ ऑल दीज नंबर्स वर्क्स वेल राइट एंड द चांसेस ऑफ कमिटिंग द एरर्स दे ग्रेटली रिड्यूस सो नाउ लेट्स अप्लाई दिस टू हैव एन एडिशन प्रॉब्लम वेयर वी हैव डेसिमल्स एंड द नंबर ऑफ डेसिमल प्लेसेज ऑल्सो आर डिफरेंट बिफोर द डेसिमल ऑल्सो एंड आफ्टर द डेसिमल ऑल्सो नाउ वट डू वी डू हियर यू हैव टू डू द सेम थिंग एक्सेप्ट दैट यू शुड गो वर्टिकली डाउनवर्ड्स ओके सो इन द लास्ट कॉलम यू हैव नाइन फोर एंड फोर सो नाइन प्लस फोर इज थर्टीन सो गुट एड आउट सो थ्री थ्री प्लस फोर सेवन सी द सेम थिंग ओके सो वन प्लस एट नाइन नाइन प्लस सिक्स फिफ्टीन सो गुट एड आउट फाइव फाइव प्लस सिक्स इलेवन सो गुट एड आउट एंड वन वन प्लस सिक्स सेवन सो वी हैव टू सेवन एट द एंड स्टार्ट द नेक्स्ट कॉलम वन प्लस थ्री फोर फोर प्लस सेवन इलेवन सो गुट एड आउट वन वन प्लस वन टू प्लस एट टेन मीन्स गुट एड आउट एंड जीरो एंड सिक्स प्लस थ्री नाइन नाउ द डेसिमल कम्स इन हियर एंड स्टार्ट द नेक्स्ट कॉलम वन प्लस सिक्स सेवन सेवन प्लस नाइन इज सिक्सटीन सिक्सटीन मीन्स गुट एड आउट एंड सिक्स सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन नाइन प्लस सेवन सिक्सटीन अगेन सो गुट एड आउट सिक्स सिक्स प्लस टू एट नेक्स्ट कॉलम वन प्लस फोर प्लस फाइव इज टेन सो गुट एड आउट एंड जीरो इन द माइंड वन टू एंड एट टू एंड एट टेन टेन मीन्स गुट एड आउट एंड यू हैव अ जीरो नेक्स्ट कॉलम सेवन एट एट एंड फाइव थर्टीन सो गुट एड आउट एंड रिटेन द थ्री थ्री प्लस वन फोर फोर प्लस एट ट्वेल्व सो गुट एड आउट एंड रिटेन द टू द लास्ट कॉलम फोर फाइव सिक्स एंड सेवन थर्टीन सो वन थ्री टू जीरो एट पॉइंट नाइन सेवन सेवन इज द आंसर फॉर दिस बिग एडिशन प्रॉब्लम वेर इन द डेसिमल्स वर ऑल्सो इन बॉर्ड सो यू नो एट द फर्स्ट साइट ऑफ इट यू विल से दैट नॉर्मल एडिशन इज ऑल्सो क्वाइट गुड बट येस द चांसेस ऑफ एरर्स यू नो इट इज अ रिसर्च बेस्ड स्टेटमेंट विच आई एम गिविंग इफ यू don't go beyond 18 in adding all the digits which lie one below the other then the chances of errors greatly reduce and when you add 30s and 40s you know single digit numbers to 30s 40s that's where the errors come from so if that complexity is reduced then mental addition can be done very very easily so this was the video in which i tried to give you an error free short trick to add large numbers mentally Do practice this and let me know in the comments did it benefit you all the best